Do you want to kickstart your e-learning development career in 2020? In this video, I'll share what I think are the best ways to start learning Storyline 360 in 2020 and beyond. Hi, I'm Mark Sperman from Upward Online Learning, where I teach you how you can create e-learning modules yourself with Articulate Storyline. And are you new here? And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell notification icon so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. Are you ready? Then let's get started. If you're watching this video, then you're probably on your way to become an e-learning developer and need to get a good starting point on how to work with Articulate Storyline. Now maybe you're asking yourself if it's hard to learn Articulate Storyline and I can assure you Storyline is easy to learn. Certainly if you have some experience with Microsoft PowerPoint, because Storyline has the same look and feel as PowerPoint and it also works with slides. This makes it incredibly easy to transfer your PowerPoint knowledge into Storyline and start building your own e-learning courses. But even if you have not that much PowerPoint experience, Storyline is really not that hard to master. And there are multiple ways to master Articulate Storyline online. You can for instance download a free 60 day Articulate Storyline trial and practice with it. But there are other ways to learn Storyline more efficiently, both paid and free. Now let's start with some options to learn Storyline when you're on a tight budget. Oh, and before I forget, you can find all the links in this video in the description below. So let's check out our first free option. The first way to start if you have little or no experience with Articulate Storyline is to go through the Articulate Storyline user guide and follow the instructions for the different subjects. So you can learn, for instance, how to work with layer in Articulate Storyline, here how to add layers, duplicate layers, and here step-by-step -step, Articulate de uh, describes what you must do to add a new layer, duplicate or copy layers, or for instance, rename layers. And this also for, for instance, if you want to import your slides from PowerPoint, or if you want to work with quiz slides. So when you completed the most of the instructions in the Articulate Storyline user guide, it's time for a next step in your Articulate Storyline learning process. And what is a better way than learning how other people created things in Articulate Storyline and deconstruct them? On the Articulate Storyline community forum, you can find lots of templates that other community forum members created. And you can try to think for yourself which techniques and Storyline Functions user used to create the example. And after that, you can download the example, open it in Storyline and see what the structure is, which triggers are used and how the example is set up with the timeline, with layers and with states. And ne the good next step is to see if you can build your own version of the example to learn to work with Articulate Storyline. Now, if you have a little feeling with Articulate Storyline with the, uh, with the functions, a good next step is to participate in weekly e-learning challenges that are hosted through Articulate. So if you built your first slides in Storyline, a good next step in your journey is to learn Storyline and into compete in the weekly e-learning challenges hosted by David Anderson on the community forum. And these challenges are a good way to put your learned Articulate Storyline skills in practice and use your creativity to build really cool stuff in Articulate Storyline. And here you can see there's each week, week has a different team. For instance, uh, your Star Wars team or uh, an interactive infographic or uh, a Christmas team. So you can uh, uh, put in your creati crea creativity into work to build something in Articulate Storyline and show them to the rest of the Articulate Community Forum. And a good next step to learn a Storyline and fully master it is helping other people with their Storyline issues on the Community Forum. So if you go to the Discuss Forum and go to Articulate Storyline, you see that there are a lot of users with questions and you learn uh, which problems they encounter and you can help fellow Articulate users with it and you can also develop problem solving skills for if something goes wrong in one of your own mod storyline modules. And this is a way you learn faster to fix issues. Now if you want to become an e-learning developer but don't have a job then it's a good idea to start a portfolio with your own Articulate Storyline work. 
Therefore, you can use your e-learning challenge submissions uh, or build pieces of courses on a topic you know a lot about, for instance, one of your hobbies. So if your hobby is gardening, build a course about in which season you must prune brushes in your garden or how to do it. Or build a course about knitting, wood carving. The subject doesn't really matter. It only makes it easier to build a project in a particular storyline and uh, view it to your uh, probably customers to see what your skills are. Now, these were the four tips to learn articulate storyline for free. But if you have money available, there are a few good ways to learn articulate storyline without re reinventing the wheel yourself. My first tip, if you have budget available, is to go to Amazon, where you can find a few books about articulate storyline. For instance, you have Articulate Storyline 3 and 360, The Essentials by Kevin Siegel and Carl Heidi, and Elon Uncovered. Article Storyline 360, the second edition by Daniel Elkins, Desiree Pinder, and William Everett. All these two books are good books if you're a storyline beginner. Uh, and if you want a physical resource to reference, then I would re recommend the Learning Uncovered Article Storyline 360. Do you want a book that's a, more, a bit more practical? Then I would recommend E-Learning 3 and 360, The Essentials by Kevin Siegel and Carl Heidi. And if you are uh, uh, some more experienced, you can also buy Articulate Storyline 3 and 360 Beyond the Essentials by Kevin Siegel and Carl Heinde to learn some more experienced storyline features. Now, the next step, if you have a budget, is to follow an online course on Articulate Storyline. Now, and there are several online courses on how to work with Articulate Storyline. For instance, on LinkedIn Learning, you can find courses or on Udemy. And you can find a direct link to the courses in the description of this video. But I think there's own one course that uh, is better than all other courses online. And this is the Articulate Storyline course on masterstoryline.com. Uh, and here you can uh, learn Articulate Storyline directly from the experts, uh, experts David Charney and Nish Zorga Juim. These guys have tons of storyline experience and their courses are, are really practical with great instructional design and visual design pra best practices and how you can apply them to Articulate Storyline. And you'll see there you have a, a storyline revision course where you learn how to uh, make adjustments in uh, a course that already exists. They learn how to create your own course from scratch, uh, how to build scenarios, and also how to uh, build, for instance, uh, gamified quiz things. And they have a just-in-time library with uh, all sort of article storyline tips and tricks. Now, if you're interested in this course, they have a yearly subscription of uh, $498, but if you enter the coupon code, uh, if you go to the sign in, not, not to the sign up in page, but one moment, if you go to the sign up page and if you click on sign up here, and if you here enter the coupon code upward online and click on apply, you get uh, a 10% discount for the first year. So now it's $448 for the first year and after that it this. Now with these tips, I hope you're ready to kickstart your e-learning development career in 2020 as an Articulate Storyline developer. If you have any questions about Articulate Storyline in common or what's best the way to learn Articulate Storyline, Give a reaction in the comments section below this video and I'll promise I will answer it. If you want to build your articulate storyline skills, then make sure you get my free step-by-step -step guide on how to create engaging e-learning in articulate storyline in less time. And I will know for sure it will help you because it shows you my exact process that I'll use for every e-learning module that I build in articulate storyline. You can, you can find my free guide on artworkonlinelearning.com slash free guide. And if this video was useful to you, then hit the like button below. And don't forget to subscribe on my YouTube channel by clicking subscribe. 
and clicking the bell notification icon so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos that I publish every Thursday on YouTube. Thanks for watching and have a great day!